Welcome back to the Red Carpet Reup, your source for the hottest music industry drama. Today, we're diving into some wild claims made by Bobby Shmurda on the Danza Project. Shmurda suggests that Jay-Z's Rock Nation is behind the rumors about Meek Mill and Diddy's relationship being more than just friends and collaborators. Now, this is some serious tea, so let's break it down. So Bobby Shmurda, who used to be managed by Rock Nation, is spilling all the tea. He says that after he and Meek Mill left Rock Nation, the company started a smear campaign. According to Bobby, it's like leaving a relationship with a powerful ex. If you cross them, they'll make your life a living hell. He claims Rock Nation is behind the rumors, even paying for thousands of comments to fuel the speculation online. Shmurda himself says he's been targeted with false rumors too, with people trying to suggest he's gay, which he denies, saying, I'm the guy who gets the most women. Let's be real. It's wild to think about the level of power he's attributing to these labels, left right? Team. I can't I'm going to tell you what's going on with Meek. I left with a team that Meek was on. Meek left that team. And I see that team. They come for you. You know what I'm saying? It's like you, you, like you got to understand everything in the relationship. It's like a relationship with these labels, right? And leaving like a girl with a lot of power. Like you could have gave her that power, you giving that girl some good dick, right? <laughs> but she has a lot of money and a lot of power. Uh, yeah. She's gonna Grand try to make your life a, a living hell. Yeah. And anything that she's gonna, she's gonna. And if we get, we own the internet. That we're gonna spread all the rumors about you. I'm gonna put a thousand, three thousand comments making jokes. I'm gonna pay for three thousand comments on every post. Word, I'm gonna, yeah, all about it. And my shit is like, it's not even. I tell me, it's not even me. It's not even that they doing it, bro. They gonna do it. They try to call me gay. I f most bitches ever. I, I think, mm -hmm. Like, come on, for real. Let's be serious. You know what I'm saying? And it's not even that. I'm not even mad at them doing it. It's be the n that believe it. Mm. Now, where do these rumors about Meek and Diddy actually come from? They're tied to a sexual assault lawsuit filed earlier this year by producer Rodney Lil Rod Jones. In the lawsuit, Jones claimed Diddy told him that he had sex with a Philadelphia rapper who once dated Nicki Minaj. Of course, people immediately assumed that meant Meek Mill, and social media went into a frenzy. Meek Mill quickly shut those rumors down, calling them sick and saying, I'm from Philly, we don't play like that. He also made it clear that he doesn't do drugs, which was another part of the allegations swirling around. It seems like Meek is fighting a serious uphill battle, trying to distance himself from these rumors. Meek didn't stop there though. He's so fed up with the rumors that He's offering $100,000 to private investigators to find out who's spreading these allegations and how his name is being dragged into Diddy's legal mess. He posted on X, formerly known as Twitter, saying he wants every detail uncovered and that something just doesn't add up. He also hinted that someone powerful is fueling this bad PR campaign against him, connecting it to his departure from Rock Nation. Meek is ready to clear his name and set the record straight even though viral moments like Diddy calling him daddy in a pool don't help matters. Hey, what's up, King Son? Man, you doing it, man. You deserve it, daddy. You putting in that work. Proud of you. I love you. Yeah. So what do you think? Are these rumors a product of industry politics and smear campaigns, like Bobby Shmurda says? Or is this just another case of the internet running wild with speculation? Either way, it's clear Meek Mill isn't taking it lightly. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for more music industry updates. Thanks for watching the Red Carpet Reup. I'll catch you in the next one.